John Venables as a 10-year-old boy after he and friend Robert Thompson killed toddler James Bulger. The pair were jailed for life in 1993 for the murder of James Bulger, but were released on licence in 2001 and given new identities. Now it's been revealed that Venables will be given a second new name, costing the taxpayer a quarter of a million pounds when he's released after serving a two-year conviction for downloading and sharing child sexual abuse images. He was sentenced on Friday and a lawyer speaking on behalf of James Bulger's mother reacted to the new conviction. We've been in court this morning and uh, once again we've had to sit through proceedings where justice has not been done. These were very serious offences and two years is simply not enough to meet the gravity of what this person did. In, in court, court it was revealed that Venables had been living in Cheshire, Cheshire and had already had two problems with the police, with the police since getting out of prison. Police. Once He'd been arrested a for a fray and was given a warning for possession of cocaine, of cocaine. But, neither but were both deemed were deemed not serious enough to send him back to jail. It's also been announced that the Ministry of Justice will launch an investigation into how Venables was handled after his release.